Gentle reminder, protection is essential to the preservation of your life while manifestation is key to the achievement of your goals. Disclaimer, gemstones are not a medical device and do not substitute medical treatment. They can enhance your healing and provide additional support to assist you during physical, emotional, mental, and kundalini healing times. If your gemstone's energies is too strong or overworking, take it off immediately and only wear it in moderation. Without further ado, let's get into this crystal composition. Beautiful day, Crystal Case and enthusiasts alike, and welcome to today's episode of Crystal Physics, hosted by yours truly, Lonnie Yasmin, aka LYC, yes, that is me. To tell you a bit about the series before we dive in, physics is the study of matter and how it behaves. Crystal physics a new time invented by yours truly is the study of crystal energy and how it behaves within the body yeah you feel me this series is designed to help anyone who is interested in gemstones and crystals alike learn more about their you know spiritual emotional mental and kundalini properties you know i'll also go over some fun facts some affirmations some correspondence and oh yeah health benefits don't forget that they're not medical devices though this is most definitely a come as you are series therefore i will be coming as comfy as i like and i expect you to do the same if my hair mess your hair mess if i can't speak you can't speak we're we're in tune we're we're together we're in check you feel me okay please use the comments to share any experiences you might have had with these gemstones and also get clarity on these stones but mostly just like share your experience you know validate that like what we're talking about here has like actually happened like it's real phenomenon we want we want the validation and with all that being said you know let's build a family guys to learn and listen more about the physical properties of these gemstones, you can go right into the description and click the link on over to Medium. Medium is an in-app listening platform that allows you to press play and listen about all the properties all day. Not just the physical ones, all the properties are over there in writing. Go on, head on over to Medium, click subscribe because nobody can find me without clicking that link for some reason. Anyways. With all that being said, let's talk about actinolite. Act what kind of a name? Actinolite has a big three that includes shielding, balance, and dream recall. It corresponds to the root, the sacral, and the solar plexus chakras. It has a projective energy. Its corresponding planets are Venus and Earth. Its corresponding zodiac is Scorpio, and its vibrational numbers happen to be four and nine. So that's stability, fulfillment. And the spirit, the, my th this this crystal doesn't have very many properties. Therefore, I would expect it to be quite strong when you encounter it, because it doesn't do much. So whatever it does, it does it well. That's for one. It's spiritual properties, right? It encourages deep meditation. So if I had to touch it, I might expect like a, a low-key psychic trip eventually. If I was like having like long exposure to this mineral. My in fact, this mineral is quite rare if you didn't know. Um, it connects you to universal energies. It assists the wearer in recalling dreams, analyzing dreams, connecting with dreams from past lives and even ancient civilizations. Its mental properties include overcoming loneliness and helping you clear and balance the mind. On the emotional property side of things, it boosts confidence, it protects your emotional body from negative energy, it pulls emotions that you have been holding like real close it pulls them right to the surface so be quite careful because you know you might tell some people some things you never expected to tell them it pushes you to release any stress and any weight off your shoulders 
um, especially any of it that you've placed on your heart particularly. It provides you with the courage and the confidence needed to face any uneasy emotions that you might encounter and it helps you find closure with those emotions. On the kundalini spectrum of things, it actually opens the heart chakra, which you would think that the heart would be a correspondent. It actually is. I just missed that. So back to the chakras, it corresponds with the root, sacral, solar plexus, and heart. And it provides your aura with a protective shield from negative energy. Huh, therefore, it would probably have to purge all the negative emotions from within out in order to do that. You know, the crystal makes more sense when you dissect it like that. Okay. Let's get in these health benefits, but remember not medical devices Ugh. not medical devices it strengthens the immune system it eliminates toxins from the body it aids in proper liver and kidney function that was a baby mosquito um one actually bit me right here in between my eyebrow and i'm honestly upset about that it rids you of nervous tensions yes yes and anxieties and it stimulates the production of white blood cells bingo what's his name oh b i n g o b i n g o b i n g o and bingo what's his name oh fun facts about acting alike all right all right we're reading don't forget that we're reading i hope y'all don't forget that we're definitely reading it gets its name from the greek word actinos which means ray or beam and it got its name they obviously named it because of the rayish beam like structures in which it grows it rarely forms as a classified good crystal pretty much just occurs in blades that are encapsulated in quartz much like a uh, forms uh, other forms of uh, is this an asbestos yes much much like other forms of asbestos it is a form of asbestos but it is submerged in quartz which makes it safe to hold but if you crush it and inhale it mm -mm. Yeah, unalived, real quick. Actinolite actually occurs in the Tremel Actinolite series of calcium, magnesium, and iron silicates. It's known as an amphibole asbestos, which just means that it's a, a rock forming asbestos. It's an, an asbestos that forms into a rock. Actinolite actually appears in two other minerals, nephrite, which is um, two different versions of jade, and cati actinolite. And in its finest quality, it's actually known as the emerald spear. It's commonly found in metamorphic rocks. Ah, and I have a singular, or I'll mix them up on the spot. Let's get into these affirmations. Don't forget your deep breath. I am surrounded by a protective shield of positive energy. I am free of harmful toxins. I release all negative emotions that I've been holding close to my heart. I am connected to the universal energies that improve my life. That is it. That is all. Thank you for coming to this very special Wednesday episode of Crystal Physics. This is the first Wednesday. Happy March 1st. Y'all already know what's, what's good. You already know what's popping. So I'm so glad that I actually you know, went through with this. Um, it might have been at the sacrifice of a video for my main channel. Um, and I might not make any videos on my main channel um, for a while. So, hey guys, I'm binging content over here right now. And I think the mosquitoes, they, they, are, they are feasting, okay? I itch. Anyways, um, yeah, with all that being said, I'm gonna catch you guys in the next one don't forget to like comment and subscribe bye